Hello, I'm Tony Virgilio, and I'm here to talk to you about the 1990 Boston Museum robbery that stole 13 artworks from the museum. So, at 1:24 a.m. on March 8th, on March 18th, there was two robberies. One was Reese Fielder, and the other was Leonardo da Mizio. They walked in the building. They stole. They they walked in the building disguised as police officers and um they asked the guard that was there to follow them into the basement so the guard followed the two robbers the thieves into the basement they beat the security guard up and tied him up and walked back upstairs they walked to the room called the dutch room and they walked to the second floor where the Dutch room was, and that's where they had, that's where their 13 of artworks were. They took about 81 minutes in the room, um, bringing artworks downstairs to the um, van, and it took them about 81 minutes to steal all that and do all that. They left a pretty good mess there. Uh, they died in a year. Um, they were associates of the Italian mar mobster Carmelo, Carmelo uh, Mer Merlin, and um, and about and and everyone thinks that um, that the artworks could be hiding in someone's attic or the. The pieces of artworks is separated and is around the country where nobody can find. So, to so, so, um, they think that no new items should be brought nor should be sold in the museum. They, they, they couldn't, the paintings can never be found to this day. This is an unsolved mystery. And, um, yeah, so it's an unsolved mystery. Nobody knows where the paintings are. The robberies are dead now. And, yeah, so this is Tony Virgilio. Back to you.